All right, welcome back, everybody, to more Let's Play Earthbound. Again, I keep forgetting to turn off the video. Okay, so, in the last episode, we failed at doing the cop fight. Of course, we also didn't fail at the first Sanctuary boss, but then again, this is also one of the, considered one of the hardest bosses in the game. One of the hardest fights in the game, so. You had to fight these five cops in a row, as you, as if you didn't know from the last episode. So, let's go ahead and bash this guy. Crushing chop. Ouch. That hurts me. Oh, look at that. Well, that was quick. What just happened? They usually take three attacks. That's odd. Maybe I just have a higher offense. Yeah, I don't believe that. I don't believe that. And... Kablam. Yeah, these guys aren't just pulling out their best for me right now. I mean, the first one started off with a crushing job, but even that, it's not so bad. Just multiply it, but... So, today is... November 3rd. I'm not fat, shut up! <laughs> As someone who's actually kind of chubby in real life, you know, it's, it hurts to hear my Claire even being called fat. It's terrible. How dare you, cop? I thought you were supposed to be some kind of superhero. They have around, what, 70 HP? I think so. Yeah, about 70 HP. Give or take. So, there you go. Nuclear suplex attack. Baby. Start off by a hammer here. Yeah, I got a higher end of the HP that I can give. Yeah. Now if I'm doing 41 damage, I should be able to take these guys out to it. Bam. Bam below me. Now this last guy, he's not gonna fight you. He's gonna be too, too scared by the fact that you took out his four buddies. But he's gonna call on Captain Strongs. Really? Wow, you're an adult and I'm a kid. That's kind of sad that you don't think you can beat me in a straight competition. Whatever. Alright, you want to start off, you want to heal up a little bit, because this guy can do quite a bit of damage by... Yeah, but she's going to start off by pretty much being on guard every time. Why did I do that? I'm so stupid. And that's his more powerful attack. Let's see if I can get a hamburger out before... Uh, yeah, he loses temper to gain uh, offense. Let me see if I can actually do PK singing this time. Uh, he keeps raising his offense. I'm gonna use a PSI an alpha to weaken him a bit. Dude, no, 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 no! Thank you. Oh my goodness, that was close. Okay. Um, should we heal again? Yeah, let's heal again. I'm scared. Came out swinging. That's his regular attack. Oh my goodness, this is scary. Scary. Ah. Alright, now let's try PK singing. Dude, stop coming out swinging. Seriously. We're not singing here. Oh, well, I guess I'm singing. Aha! I beat him! I beat him! I beat him! I win! I win! You lose! I, I win! Yep. To level 12 and vitality went up by 2. Check out my HP. 27! And PP went up by 10. Tw tw bleh, 10. And, you know, I got shield. That's very nice. Yep, I do. Beep, beep. Strong here. Do you read me? Hey, it's me, Captain Strong. Okay, listen, a kid named John will be there in a few minutes. He's a kid in a red cap. I want you to open the road to Tucson for him. I know that. I know that! Don't ask me why. Just do it. It's an order. Strong out. He even had a little phone in his sprite. That's very cool. That's very cool. I guess there's nothing else to do in this room. You could look out the window, I guess. What do you have to say? Alright. Whatever you say, man. Aww, that makes me sad. I want to drive. If I'm young enough, if I'm old enough to save the world, I should be old enough to drive. Don't you guys think? So, stuff. I'm gonna go ahead and heal up at Frank. And, um... Just to give you a sense of what I'm doing here, I'm gonna go ahead and heal up at Frank and then save the game. And call my mom because, you know, with the. Uh, yeah, this guy's gonna drop you say, yeah, every time you walk in the room. Spaceballs. Alright, talk to this guy. And you get fully healed. Very nice. 
Yeah, just so you know, the hotels, I believe, do not heal your PP, so... That is a pain in the butt, so... That is what you want to do in this town if you need, if you are in need of PP, if you can't find a magic butterfly or something. Ah, dang. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and use the payphone inside the hotel. Inside the hotel. And then we're going to make our way towards Tucson. Or Tucson, I don't know. I'm going to say Tucson because... No, nah, I'm going to say Tucson because that's how I know to say it. Yeah, you can record my data. Thanks, Dad. Yeah. Mother. Ah, uh, I'm about to call her, too. I know, me too. Yeah, I'm a hero. I'm a hero! It's okay that- it's amazing that my mom's okay with this, you know, me fighting cops and crap. Jeez, my mom's got must be like the most lenient mom in the entire world. And all this while school is still going on, you know? Like, I'm missing so much school just to fight cops. Whoa, is that a bug? What are these? Um, something that I can apparently... Whoa, they're black antoids. Well, look at that. Dude, seriously. Thank you. Life up. Dude. Seriously, what a waste of time. HP is maxed out at the beginning of the fight. Called for help. Dude. Dude. Stop it. They can't even do that much damage. They're a waste of my times. So don't call for help. Oh my goodness, if he had called for help, I would have been so pissed off. Okay. That was a waste of time and money. Well, it wasn't really a waste of money, because we gain money from fights. I took a cookie. Why do I want a cookie? I don't want a cookie. I didn't even use up all my hamburgers. Hey, well, who's in this house? I never checked. Ah, uh, just some guy. Alright. Sweet. Yeah, talk to this lady, and she'll give you an exit mouse. Yeah. So it's basically like the escape ropes in Pokemon, you can, uh, while you're inside of a dungeon, you can use the exit mouse and he will take you out of the dungeon. J just about in a very fast way. Yeah, those black antoids run away from you. <laughs> There's no real point in fighting them. Okay, let's see what this is. Hamburger. Alright. Somebody left me a gift and it happened to be a hamburger. How lucky is that? <laughs> Alright, here's some new enemies. Mushrooms. Or rambling evil mushrooms, I believe. Yep. And these guys have a really annoying feature. What? <laughs> that is awesome. I can one hit kill those guys. Uh, but if you let them live for long enough, they'll try, they'll sprinkle some spores, and it'll say that you're feeling funky. When that happens, um, basically what's just happened is, uh, well, you're about to go on a mind trip. Basically, there will be a mushroom growing on your head, and just, I'm about to take this. Dang it! Oh, the fucking crud. All right. As you can see, they already have they have about 60 HP. Dang it! When you're feeling funky, you have a chance of hitting yourself, which is dangerous. Which, yeah, which is bad. It's like being confused in Pokemon. But also, it has another feature in this game where it'll. Well, you'll see. But there's an interesting way to get rid of it, which is, uh, we'll be seeing coming up here. I'm not gonna try and fight those guys, because those guys are fat. No. Alright, when you get into town, if you have a mushroom on your head, go ahead and go to the hospital. Yeah, the hospital. Trust me. There's just a department store over there. We're gonna be going there pretty soon. that way. Sorry, um, I don't know these towns as well as I thought I did. Oh, here we go. The controls have now turned around. Okay, let's see if I can... Yeah, my controls switched. And while I have a mushroom on my head, this guy's gonna come down from the air and take a picture of me with a mushroom on my head. Jeez, man. Pictures taken in today we asleep. Look at the camera and ready say Fuzzy Pickles. What a great photograph. It will always bring back the fondness of memories. Okay. Yeah, I just made that up. Oh, dang it. I didn't mean to go in here. Let's see if I can get out of here. Jeez, man. 
having a mushroom on your head is a pain in the butt because you never know where you're going. And of course, if you're holding a controller and you figure out which direction you're going, then you can, like, um, you can hold the controller that way. But of course, the controls will switch up on you again if you get too used to them. What did I go in here for? Jeez, man. I just know my controls are gonna get screwed up again. What? What just happened to my computer? Where is the... Oh my goodness. Okay, it's a... F what the hell? Oh, I have to hit this button. Or some button. What the hell? What just happened? My computer is going glitch. Why is it not responding? Have I not? Oh, is it, is it this thing gotten loose again? Seriously, dude. Dude, seriously? What the hell? What? <sighs> there we go. Sorry. Sorry about that. That was glitch. Alright. Dang it. Alright, the controls are switched again. There we go. No, there we don't go. Like, upside down? Yeah, it's upside down. They can only switch it up on you so much. But, oh! I don't want to get into a battle right now because I have a mushroom on my head and I've had it on for quite some time now. Is this the hospital? Is this the hospital? Which, where, where's the hospital? Somebody, can somebody point me in the direction of a hospital, please? Is it this way? Yeah, it's this way. Th those definitely look like hospital bushes. Uh, I wish I could control this. First controls, pain in the butt. I can't figure out which way I'm going. There we go. And now let's not just like randomly go outside. Okay. Okay, that's if that's right now, then this must be No! Dang it! Ah Oh, the controls went back to normal. What the heck? Alright, talk to this guy. Yeah, and now you can sell him the mushroom that's growing on top of your head. And both, you'll get $50, and you'll also get healed. So, you won't have a mushroom on your head. He doesn't heal your HP, but he heals you, so that's nice. Definitely a good thing. If you, uh... We can't really grind money off of that, because, I mean... <laughs> who's gonna go to the trouble of going to all those battles, you know? probably earn more money just from being around, battling those guys, and winning, you know. Uh, also, I have some news as to... Oh, no, no. Yeah, okay. I have some news as to my, uh, The whereabouts, I don't know, of my Crystal Let's Play. If people are waiting for that, I'm sorry. I'm just not feeling that right now. I'm sorry. Yeah, you can pay, stay at the hotel for free if you've just gotten a mushroom off your head. And you will get this dream sequence. John? John? John, I am a friend who I've never... My name is Gabby. Uh, I think I've met Gabby. She, she goes to my school. Speaking of schools... We are in Tucson. There's a school here. Oh, it's preschool, but still... off for today. Well, I'll, sh uh, I'll go into the department store in the next episode, and we'll get some new equips and stuff. So I'll see you in the next episode with uh, more Earthbound, which I will probably be recording right now. So I'll see you in the next part of Let's Play Earthbound. Uh, and God bless you.